Hey everybody, so I uh, got uh, a nice little stack of mail here. I've been stockpiling it up all week and uh, I got a nice mix of stuff here. Um, I got some private signings that came in. I've got some stuff that came back in record time uh, very fast and I've got some stuff that broke my record for longest return. So uh, it's a kind of a mixed bag today, but let's get into this. My first one is a 404 in 32 days from, got uh, Bill Kruger. Works on uh, Root Sports Northwest on the 91 Fleer update. The 91 Bowman. 92 Tops. And the 91 Fleer Ultra. Really happy with how all of those turned out. But uh, I really think this uh, 91 Fleer really pops the best. Alrighty, next is a 3 of 3 in 7 days. I did go through past pros on this one. I think he was $8 each through. But we got Ken Clay on the 82 Tops. 81 tops and the 82 Fleer and those are all of his Mariners cards happy to be done with that next is a one of one in 10 days from a former top Mariner prospect Kim Allen and I believe this is his only card uh, I don't remember if it was injuries or something really slowed him down, but he came out of the gates really hot, and I think within a year he was playing in Japan, so I don't remember. I lo did look him up. I don't have to do that again. Alrighty, next is a one-of-one one in seven days. Very fast return. Saw this guy's been signing recently. He's had to get this done. Scott Service for the set. Real happy to have that, and I did see uh, Shane Turner does sign a bit. So, uh, but I know he did play for the Mariners too. So I ordered some uh, his Mariners cards, and once I get those in, I'll be sending this off and hopefully finishing this duel for the you know what. All right, uh, this one was a really awesome return. It was a four of four in thirteen days from. Gary Gray signed the 83 Donruss, 83 Tops, 82 Tops, and the 83 Fleer. Now, what made this return so awesome is he wrote me a letter back. And when I was writing this letter, this is my letter right here. He wrote on the back of mine. Uh, there wasn't. I didn't really have a whole lot to say to him because he didn't really have much of a career. So I put that it had been fun playing for Rene Latchman because he was the manager of the Mariners when Gary Gray played. And then he ended up playing in Mexico, so I thought that would have been a cool experience. And that was basically the extent of my letter. And then he wrote all this back. And this was really nice. He said, Sam, playing for Rene Latchman was a blast. We played against each other for three years in the Pacific Coast League, so we had a lot of respect for each other. Before we got to Seattle, we were lifetime minor leaguers. Even though he wanted to play me every day, his hands were tied, he was the manager, but his orders came from higher up, a true friend. Playing in Mexico, yes, was a great experience, definitely unforgettable. It was an honor and privilege to play with and against some of Mexico's legends. Every town I played in in Mexico, the people treated me special. Moments I will always treasure. All my best, Gary Gray. So that was a really great return. Really happy to have that. Alrighty, next is a 2 of 2 in 10 days from another former top prospect of the Mariners. We got uh, Jim Mailer on the 83 and the 84 tops. This guy was going to be a big-time star, and unfortunately, I think within his first week of playing in the major leagues, he had a 
bad knee injury, which he continued to re-hurt, and that really ended his career, unfortunately. And these were the only two cards he has. So, unfortunate there. I believe he still has some hitting records at, I think, Florida State University, or he had some that did for a long time. All right, next is a 3 of 3 in 14 days. Uh, this person does uh, charge, but it's kind of unclear how much, so I sent him three cards and $10, and he signed all three. I got Danny Tartable on the 86 Mother's Cookie, which looks amazing. Got him on the 86 Fleer. And the 85 Fleer. And uh, I believe Steve Kiefer signs, and I think I've actually gotten him before. So I'll look into that, and this may be going out again. Let's see, we got to feature that Mother's Cookie. That's a beautiful card. I have to move somebody. I'll cover it. We'll move Kim. Alrighty, next. This is my record. This is the longest return I've ever had. It was eight days shy of one year. A two of two in 356 days from Butch Hobson. Signed my 77 tops and the 82 Donruss. So I thought this was long gone. When I sent this out, I got an RTS because he had just moved. But I did get a forwarding address on my yellow sticker. So I sent it there, and it never came back, so I didn't think that I was ever going to see these again. So that was a nice surprise. All right, and next, the final TTM. I didn't think I was ever going to see this one again either. It's a 4 of 4 in 283 days from Brett Butler. Great leadoff hitter, signed my 83 Fleer. 88 Tops. The 92 Leaf and a 93 Upper Deck. All right, let's get into these private signings. Got some really awesome ones here. So, this first one comes from one of the greatest shortstops of the 2000s, if not the greatest. We've got Jack Wilson. Played most of his career for these Pirates here, but he did come to Seattle. And had a minute with the Braves. So I got the rest of these for my Mariners PC. Signed my 2009 tops, which I think turned out amazing. Got the 2009 tops heritage. A 2010 tops. And a 2011 tops. So really happy to add that to the collection. I was really excited when uh, he was doing a signing. And uh, he's also the current manager coach for Team USA. So when those uh, Panini Stars and Stripes come out, that's his team. All right, next I've got, I only sent into this one because he was signing really cheap. And I believe it was charity. But we got Brian Hunter on the 93 Fleer Ultra. He's got kind of a nice signature there. Of the 92 tops. And a 91 upper deck. Alright, and the final one. We've got Teddy Higuera on the 87 Don Russ Diamond King. And the 89 Fleer for the set. Alright everybody, that is my mail for this week. Hope you all had a great week. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your weekend and see ya.